There, there is the, the uh, you know, low potential, low risk potential of uterine fibroids to be cancerous. Uh, oftentimes, this is a, a, a cancer diagnosis called leiomyosarcoma. Uh, and we don't know which fibroids are cancerous and which are not. Uh, but we do know that uh, the vast majority, uh, upwards of you know, 99% of fibroids are benign. Uh, and there are recent studies in, in premenopausal women have indicated that uh, the rate of, of a cancerous fibroid of the uterus is probably somewhere in the range of one in 10,000 or more. Uh, but again, it comes down to uh, the the patient and the and the doctor determining what's best for their approach. Uh, predominantly, fibroids that are present in a postmenopausal woman have a higher, significantly higher chance of being cancerous. And in those in those cases, uh, it would it would not be recommended to remove that type of fibroid in an uncontained fashion. Uh, and so, so we would approach that patient differently than say a. 25 or 35 year old woman that has that has fibroids that's concerned about childbearing and fertility